At least somebody appreciates me. Stop hiding. I'm not matching. And? It's when so do I match? I'm wearing red plaid and purple. I'm wearing a green shirt and like crazy colored pants. Jess, we're in quarantine. Nobody cares. Come closer. No. Yes. No, come here. You come here. We got a runway. Let's see a fashion show. Come on. No. Why not? You wanted to vlog. Okay, welcome back to me vlogs. Let's get out of the hallway. Got the hall monitor right here. He made sure everything was okay. Quick we're good check. to go. Now we don't supervise him, he supervises us. He does. Yeah, and if we're not paying attention, he bites us. <laughs> don't you little man. So we have an interesting addition to our home. We have the very first wedding photo that we've ever had on a wall in a house. And here it is. You decided to put a sign up that has her last name on it. <laughs> the first wedding picture, it looks really good. It's really huge. Like this, we had to like put the frame together. It took like two months to get here, but it looks really good. Decorative wood. <laughs> so, since I just put up a video, on my main channel about um, creepy games that supposedly send you to other worlds, mystical worlds, to see the unicorns, the magical places. I thought we would play one today, but I thought we would play the weirdest, probably simplest one called the Fed Up Game. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, pause this video, open a new tab, or if you're on your phone, you can have tabs on your phone. Go watch my other video first. I feel like and I come don't even need to know the rules of this. This is just adult life. You're just fed up. About everything. Taxes, bills, the fact that even though, you know, we tidied up the house, there's already dog hair everywhere. Yeah. The fact that Winnie wants to go outside for the fifth time in 10 minutes. So interesting enough, this game came out in 2008 in Japan. And supposedly, if you're fed up with the world that you live in now, if things aren't going well for you, if you're just not liking how this world is, you can leave this world and go to another magical place. I feel like we all <laughs> kind of- That sounds terrible. What do you mean? You don't want to go to a magical place? Out of this world, go to the other one. Yeah. It's just terrible. Go to another world, but I was gonna say, I feel like people really relate to this game right now because the state of the world, I wanna go to a magical universe with unicorns. You know what I mean? I'm fed up. Are you? This Comment sounds, down below if you're fed up. This sounds like they're trying to jazz up depression, Jess. Yeah, kind of. Yeah, that's why I said it sounds terrible. <laughs> there is a warning about this game though, and it says that if you wanna go to this other magical realm, you can't come home. You can't come back to this world, so. Anyway, this is how it goes. You get a blank piece of paper. Before you go to bed, you write on the piece of paper, I'm fed up, all right? You write it on that piece of paper. You put it underneath your pillow. You go to sleep, and in the morning, you'll know you're in this other world if you lift up your pillow and the paper is gone. And at first, it might seem like, oh, it looks like my same normal world, but once you like step outside and really look around, like maybe there's a unicorn over there, then you know, you're not in the same world. There's another rule that says you have to put I'm tired on the paper and it works the same way. So maybe I'll write I'm fed up and Ty will write I'm tired. And then you like put it underneath your pillow like the tooth fairy and then you see what happens. And then the magical fed up fairy comes up. Yeah, the fed up fairy yeah, comes. The fed up fairy. You're supposed to like dream about the world you want to enter. I feel like I want to go to like Middle Earth. Can I dream about that? With all the orcs? Not the orcs. I want to go to Middle Earth after the third movie when everything's good. Sort of. It, it doesn't get better. It does though. I'm pretty confident it doesn't. Destroying There's evil. There's still creatures. Extended works. You, you should read them. You okay? By the way, we just got this um, toy bin right here a couple days ago. And Tumnus loves to go inside of it like a cave. We'll show some videos here of the last couple days of him just like crawling inside it unprovoked. And he just loves to be in there. It's his own Tumnus cave, so. 
That's how it's been. I think Winnie's fed up. Winnie's fed up. We're all fed up, all um, right? What's she up. doing? Oh my gosh, she's so fed up. Hello? Are you fed up? Yeah, she's fed up. <laughs> Definitely. We'll report back to you tonight when we write stuff on these papers and put them under our pillow. This is definitely a very weird game. But yeah, I guess if you don't see this vlog go up, we went to another world. Unless it has internet. In How the would they world. know if the vlog didn't go up? Our posting schedule is already erratic at this. <laughs> but like if they never see this video, then we probably never came back. Unless this other mystical world still contains YouTube. You never know. Anyway, we'll see you guys later. Mr. Thomas. It's the next day now. I got ready first because I have a very busy day and you don't want to see my wake up face because it's like, it's kind of like a mood face, my wake up face. That's to that. <laughs> so, next day now, we're gonna go over and we're gonna see if the slips, the papers are still underneath our pillows. If not, that means I've been doing my makeup in who knows where. And you let the dogs out today. I let the dog out. Thomas still stays inside. When you looked around, did you see anything weird? I mean, Winnie didn't want to come inside. She didn't? Uh-uh. No, she ran behind some trees over there. She never does that. That means it's a new dog. It's Doesn't... not actually Winnie. See, when you say it's a new dog, I'm thinking like the thing or something like that. So it's going to get all like tentacly up in here and not in a good way. Ew. Imagine if the world we're in right now is the one from The Thing. Have you guys seen that movie? Probably not. It's from like the 70s, I think. <laughs> it's, a it's a really good horror movie. We watched it for the first time probably back in the fall. And it's creepy. Like the dog is disguised as the creepy alien. No, thank Spoilers, you. Spoilers, Jess. I don't think Spoilers. they're Spoilers. Gonna... Not really. Anyway, let's go over and we're going to see. Okay, you check yours first, Ty. I have a dog, so let's just... There. You can chill there. So is there anything that's supposed to be happening with this? Since you have it back, that means you're in your normal world. Okay. If it was gone, who knows where you would be. So I would assume that means that mine's there because if it's not, that's a little bit confusing. Cause how am I filming this then? I'm fed up. <laughs> yeah, it's actually quite a relief to see these because I kind of like our life. I'm kind of good with our world. You know what I mean? I don't really need another one there unless Unless it's like Hogwarts or something, then I want to be a wizard. You'd leave your whole family behind just to be a wizard? Definitely. No, I, I would take- About 90% of the people would say yes. I would take my family with me. We'd all live in Hogwarts Castle. Even though we're too old to go there now. Just, just break in. Sad. Just pretend break to be a kid. <laughs> break in and take You over. look like you're 16 anyways. No, I don't. You've played a 16 year old when you were 20. Yeah, you're fine. I think I played a 15 year old. Anyway. Hope you guys enjoyed this fun little video that we did. Just to let you know, we have a lot of new things up on the website. If you did not get a mystery box, whatever items we had left that were in the mystery box, we're actually selling separately on the website. So if one thing caught your eye, it could be there. Check it out, we'll link it down below. We also got some new summer stuff. We have popsicle bags and we have new pop sockets for the summer. So go check it out. And I hope you guys have an awesome rest of your day and we'll see you in our next video. Bye. See you guys. Bye.